hear me? I'm right here, Shades. I don't hear you. Can you hear me now? Can you hear me now? Yes, I can. Sorry, the stupid headset shut itself off. Yes, I was saying I just started recording, so yeah. Yeah, I didn't even know you were going to be on. Luckily, I checked. Um, it's been really glitchy, the game. Like, the other world I was in was all, like, um, going very slow and moving like this. I almost quit the game because it was just too much. Like, three worlds in a row were just moving around, and the graphics was all messed up. Oh, um, good thing I went up upstairs and checked my phone when I did, because I wouldn't have known you were on. Because I didn't check Facebook either. And I just went upstairs, oh, maybe I should check my phone for whatever. And then I just saw that, oh, you were on about a half hour ago, so whoop, better hop on if you're still yeah. on. I got, I got like caught up with cleaning and stuff and then um, like, I, like yeah, I was just, I just realized like, oh, I can go on my neck's not too bad. But when, but before a little while ago, like three worlds in a row were glitching on me really bad and froze, like freezing up. Now it says my headset is low. Oh man. But I, had, I thought I had my headset fully charged because like. I had it plugged in last time. Maybe I left it on by mistake, like didn't power it off completely. Because it should have some more juice left in it, but it's saying headset low. Dang it. It's always something. Yeah. Dang it, dang it. So, sorry about that, but hopefully I can be on for a little bit longer. Nice, brother. I, saying that, cause I have that long links cable that's like 16 feet long, but what I noticed lately, and for a while now, it seems to not be working that good. Like, it charges my devices, but very, very slowly. Uh, sounds like time I for a new cable, yeah. It's really... Yeah, I don't think... It's too bad. Like, I spent $20 on it, but... Maybe it wasn't worth 20 bucks. Like, so maybe I should just find another one, but, like, for cheaper if they have it. Yeah, for maybe sure. Timu has it. By the way, Timu is seriously addicting. Have you been on Timu, the app? or the website because they have like the sickest stuff that looks so cool so trendy but for really cheap i never heard and of team moon until you just mentioned it now <laughs> is it like oh, close okay it's it's everything you could think of clothes um household items um stuff for pets stuff for anything back braces um everything pillows everything you could think of it's almost like amazon but better and cheaper than amazon like more variety and cheaper and That's... they have really badass stuff on there like fashion for guys is off the chain. randy with glasses <laughs> i couldn't help like looking at their shoes earlier and for guys alone it's amazing what you can find and for really cheap like, for $25 and under, you can get, like, the coolest pairs of sneakers or shoes or whatever for, for guys. Like, it's it's really cool. It, it, years ago, like, all we had was, like, Kmart or Walmart <laughs> for discount stuff. And, you know, the styles were always, like, kind of, like, meh. You know, like, not that cool. But nowadays, now, more variety. Is, like, this is, like, Kmart, Walmart, um prices even cheaper and like the styles are like wow you could get a whole wardrobe like for um sixty dollars or less and just get like it's it's just, it's just cool it's t-i-m-u it's right cool. and i saw like yeah uh t-e-m-u i think oh -E -E. okay good thing i asked <laughs> t-e-m-u I, I just saw uh, yeah and their logo is orange I just saw, like, so many things on there that I thought, like, oh, Shades Man would like this. Shades Man would like that. Like, really remind me of, like, your style. I gotta check out after this session. Stuff. Yeah. Yeah, like, the sporty sneakers on there are just mind-blowing. Like, they're they're so cool. <laughs> they're really, like, the, de the details that they make on these sneakers. Now, maybe they won't last for, like, a long time i don't know because they're cheaper maybe they're not made to run in so they might just be more for the fashion aspect but uh -huh. they're i don't know but they're really cool looking 
Yeah, I think things like... Healthcare isn't necessarily what you pay is what you get, but sneakers is what you pay is what you get. If I spend $17, it probably won't last long. But yeah, I should still check. I'm still want to check it out. I'm very That's curious true. now. But the, yeah, the styles made me think of you, like like a lot of the sneaker styles. Um, they just have so much. They have so much on there. And it's instead of like having to go to the store and like buy like, let's say like you need a knee brace, for instance. Let's just say that. Instead of going uh -huh. to the store, using gas and that money and then spending like... 30 to 50 dollars on a brace you can get one on there for like three dollars or maybe a little bit more but not that much so it's like that's the price difference and like the convenience of it and you get so much to choose from like when we go into these stores it's always like the same items in every store so um so oh did you hear from calling eagle i kind of let him know i was going on too but last minute so yeah i said it just five minutes ago yeah i mean we said it in the group chat yeah, but you sent it in the group chat, but they might he might not necessarily check it, so I individually messaged him, but who knows if he'll check it or not. I didn't even I didn't message anybody earlier today because I didn't think you'd be you'd be able I didn't even honestly think you'd make it honestly, but I guess you did so. Okay. I'll be better organized soon, definitely. Um just like a lot was going on and my mom's car is having issues, so yeah. Oh right. Among the uh with the tail light and all that stuff too or whatever. Or the uh overhead tail whatever it is, yeah. Oh, right, but my car's running good, but, like, hers is, like, wobbling back and forth when she breaks, so, not so good. Oh, right, a different car, yeah. Yeah, so, you, after, after the other day, you didn't have any, like, bumps on your legs and stuff, did you? Like, I think I have a few mosquito bites, or something. Um, I did not, I don't think, um, I don't, I don't think I did, no. Yeah, because I had a few bumps after. I didn't notice any mosquitoes. I was like, did the, did the jellyfish do it? I don't know. But I think maybe the mosquitoes. It's probably mosquitoes, honestly. Because I usually don't wear shorts. And when I went into the ocean, I actually had shorts on for the first time, like, ever. So that's why I suddenly have these yeah, bumps on my legs, yeah. Well, it could have been when you got out of the water, then the mosquitoes might have went after you yeah, at the bay where we were at. That's why I wanted to get changed really quick. When I got out of the water, I changed, put my pants on, put a long sleeve shirt on, and then bug sprayed wherever I could. And sometimes they bite me through my clothes because I wear, because I have, you know, thin clothes on even if they're pants. Because it's summertime, so I'm not going to wear, like, thermal pants. So I still use some bug spray, like, over, you know over myself so in the water i didn't really feel any bugs on me but as soon as i got out i made sure change as fast as i could and put some bug spray and definitely get bu uh, bug spray because yeah you don't want to get bit too many times yeah all it takes is the wrong mosquito to bite you and then oh i got a pair or whatever they have yeah yeah i got bit a bunch of times not that long ago but luckily the bites went away pretty fast so that's good it didn't bother me like a bunch of days I have a mysterious, like, bruise on my right hand today. I don't know how I got there. I don't remember hitting my hand. Do you remember me ever hitting my hand on Saturday and saying, ow, like, how did this happen? Because I don't remember. Like, usually I'll say something like, ow, like, if I hit my hand. But I don't remember doing it. So I'm like, where did I have this bruise from? Yeah, me neither. Because sometimes, sometimes bruises show up, like, a couple of days after you hit yourself. So yeah, I don't know. I just don't know. I don't know how it got there. It's a mysterious bruise. Does it look like a little thing, or is it like a bigger thing? Like a, like a, is it like tiny, or is it like a few inches, or whatever? Oh no, it's at least an inch big. Okay, so it's not the same thing as the as the uh, what the bites in my leg, so to speak, because those are like they're like almost yeah. pimples, but they're not a pimple. They're they're just really hard instead. So it's not like I could drain them because they're just too hard. And even, a, I'm talking about like a pimple that's not, doesn't have are like a whitehead, just... Are they itchy because... Are they very itchy because my, mosquito bites itch? Maybe a little bit, and if I like put a sock over it, it's very minor, but some of them might itch. But if only if I move okay, if fabric they're, over if it, they're yeah. tiny little bumps, if they're tiny little bumps, that's not a mosquito bite. That's something else. Like about a, a centimeter, up to, up to a centimeter, not even like big. That's about to die. Want to go jump in the pool quick? Come on. Yeah, sure.
I don't know where the pool is. Come to think of it. There, that's how you get to the swimming pool. Yeah, I made it. Look at that water, huh? Wee! Time to go for a swim. Swim to go for a time. Look at those floating flotation devices. I'll take him off the. It. Whoops. Uh. Oh, oh shit! There's my drink. My drink. Here you go, Shades. Here's a drink. Can you grab? I don't know if you can grab that. Oh, your drink fell down. Uh, I <laughs> got it. <laughs> oh, shit. There goes my drink. Now I gotta swim to the bottom of this pool. Oh, I gotta hold it. In real life, this would be like 20 feet deep, right? Or I yeah, know. it'd be rather deep in real. This is a deep pool in real life, yeah. Like 13 feet at least, or more. Seems pretty deep. Yeah, well, if you're measuring based on the size of your avatar, your avatar would be like five feet tall. So it'd be at least it'd be 20, 25 feet. I'll just say 20 feet. Twenty feet deep. Okay, now how do I get back up? Oh, there we go. I am holding on to my drink for dear life because I have to hold my left mouse button. Other objects I can just click once and it holds, but other times it doesn't work that it's way. It's kind of fun though to throw. It's kind of fun. Let's throw as many drinks as we can in the pool. Oh yeah, where are the other Come drinks? On. Oh yeah, I see them. I'm wedged in here. Oh no, I'm stuck. Some of these I can't pick up. Oh, here we go. Here's the glass. Ah, uh, yes. The glass doesn't go in the water. The glass doesn't go in the water. Well, I just dropped it in the water. It doesn't float, but I, dr I can drop it in. Yeah, this one doesn't, though. This one doesn't go in the water. This one... That's weird. ...goes where you put it. So if I throw items in the water, do they eventually respawn in the area they came from? Is that what happens? Like, they'll eventually just, like, disappear from the water and appear back in their original spot? Is that how this works? Um, only if you restart the world again and go into a new one. Otherwise, they'll be where you left them. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, these bigger bottles, I... I, I can let go, and then when I let them go, the, I can click, left click and let go, oh yeah. My god. This is such a satisfying sound when it pours. Oh my gosh, that's such a satisfying sound, I love it. And it's so weird, because when I don't have to hold down the left mouse button, I right click to let go, and it stays floating there, it doesn't drop down. I guess different objects work differently. Respawn beer system, that's how you can do it too. Beer system. That's what it's called. It's not just beer, it's a beer system. <laughs> That's funny. It's such a satisfying sound, though, when it pours. I love that sound. Uh, and I can't even hear it. Even though I don't drink, even though I don't drink beer. Look at that city skybox, it's funny. It looks like the real deal. VR chat, here we come. Oops, I walked in front of your view. 
that's okay. What city is this, though? That's the question. Fictionville, an SA. Selfie time! It's so funny, I take pictures in real life and then... Selfies, yeah. Hopefully I'm in the picture. I'm not sure if you can see my character in the selfie. Guess I'll find out later. Eh. Oops, she disconnected. That means she's probably out of power. Oh, better something than nothing. As for me, this is the Shades Man signing off. Peace.